Let's now learn how to declare variables that reference to objects inside your game. For example, here I have a red block and a ball, and they are inside the workspace. So now I'm going to go to the ball, I'm going to add a script, and I want to declare a variable named ball that reference to the ball. So ball equals to, and let's take a look. So my script is here. The ball is the parent of the script. So I'm just going to say ball equals to script not parent. Now this variable here is referencing to this ball object inside the workspace. And whenever I want to change anything in the ball, for example, change the property, I'm just going to use this variable here to change its property and the ball's property is going to be changed. Now, what if my script is not inside the ball, but it's inside the block here. So here's my block. Let me rename this to make everything clear. All right. So now what if the script is inside the block and I want this variable ball to reference to the ball? How would I do that? The answer is I would have to traverse this explorer hierarchy to get to the ball. So my block is right here. And to get to the ball, I would have to go up to the workspace and come back down to the ball. So from here, from the script, let's say, so we have the block is script.parent. So script.parent is going to get me to the block. But then I need to go up more. So that's going to be dot parent again, because the workspace is the parent of the block. So I have to do another dot parent here. And then to get to the ball, I'm going to go from the workspace. So right now we are at the workspace. To get to the ball, we have to do dot ball. And that is how we reference to the ball from a script inside the block. Another way to get to the ball from the script is just to start at the root and go down. So to start at the root, you're going to say ball equals to game dot workspace. So now we are inside the workspace now, and we just have to get down to the ball. So we do dot ball. Here's another scenario here. So what if my ball is not inside a workspace, but it's inside one of these services? So all these here are services. What if it's inside the server storage? So the ball is inside the server storage. How would I reference to the ball from the script over here? Well, first thing we're going to do is we're going to declare that service. So the service that the ball is inside is the server storage. So we're going to say local server storage. We're just declaring a variable here equals to game colon get service server storage. And now we can declare the ball by saying local ball equals to server storage, which is our variable here, dot ball. And that is going to reference to the ball inside the server storage. And those are the different ways you can traverse the explorer hierarchy to get to the objects inside the explorer.